I'm not going to make you go through any more agony. So, Adam, Adam, used to get Adam out previously here. known as Adam Patch. Mm -hmm. Adam used to get out of here at 12, 1 o'clock. Yeah. It seems pretty out, of, out of the old building. That was back in the old days. Uh, this is really this is very weird. strange. It's really weird. Very strange. Uh, Adam Hochran, uh, Point of Woods. Um, I've been here in about a year and a half. Um, I've been here, so I want to congratulate the former Captain Mayfield on being Township Manager Mayfield. <coughs> And uh, the former Mrs. Kingdon, on being former Mrs. Kingdon. Um, and Lou? Please. And Lou. Yeah, yeah. An another new I, I don't know him. I don't know who he is. No, no, it's all new. Know. He's the new CFO. <laughs> yeah. So it's okay. It's okay. Um, <coughs> I've lived here uh, in town about eight years, and things have changed a lot in just the past year and a half. But one thing that hasn't changed is the first responders. And this weekend, the Howell First Aid Squad had a big fundraiser for cancer research, which was great. They changed their uh, ambulance, they made it pink. It's just something that makes Howell a special place. Um, in my new job, I've gotten to travel all around the country and I've seen different towns and Howell's very special. There's, that's all there is to it. Um, I also wanted to congratulate uh, the new chief, Andy Kudrick. Uh, Mr. Mayor, in your speech, you said that, you know, you have a list of people you count on and Andy's one of those guys. Yep. When I was with Patch, Andy was one of those guys. You knew you were going to get a good deal with him and he was going to tell you that. <coughs> And I have no doubt that he's going to do that. Um, I do have some questions. I haven't seen anything about the hotel since I wrote a story about it, and that was probably about a year and a half ago. Is that dead? Is that still coming? The hotel they were going to build on Route 9. They're still going to build it. Is there a name? Is there a brand? No, nothing. Because Mr. Gazrowski appealed the Route 9 development to the Board of Review, and they approved it. So how long is that in, it, that's just stuck? Okay. Um, and I've seen that it's obviously. It's not how we do it, so you know. What was that? Somebody sued because they didn't want oh. a hotel. <coughs> oh, I, I remember. <laughs> but it's gone through one round, right? Right, second round. Okay. okay. Um, and I've seen that obviously the VFW is moving into their new home, which is great, and Powell's moving into the old tax building, which is great. I didn't know, because I drove by the old engineering building, and that's still there. That's getting knocked down, right? Huh? It's what I do. You know, nobody else is doing it, so I figured it out. Okay. And where are we with the old town hall? Is that any is plans for that? Is that still up? That's still there. Yeah, that's, that looks like it's never been touched. <laughs> no. You know, I had many memories there. That thing hasn't done. fallen down? It's yeah. still mothballed. Okay. Um, and I know one of your big things, uh, Dep Deputy Mayor Castro, was the clock factory. Has anything happened with that? That, that? that building's not there anymore, but obviously it's just the foundation. Yeah, so. that's, you know, it's owned by a private citizen, so he's... This yeah. Deputy Mayor did a real good job. Gee. All right, getting on that to get that building ripped <coughs> out. It was an eyesore there for 15, 20 years. Oh, I remember. I remember. And I, I didn't know if, if you know, uh, other older buildings that have been abandoned are being knocked down. Moon. The Moon Motel. I'll take credit for that one, too. Yeah. <laughs> are you guys should save that sign somehow. That's like a Howell landmark. That should be, like, sure. Yeah, we may. We, 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 uh... Yeah, you got an extra room? That's not a bad no. idea. <laughs> I know. I think nope. that sign is beyond its restoration period. Yeah. I don't see that ever coming back. Probably. Yeah. It's only like Bates it Motel, okay? Yeah. The sign it's will the be there for a while. I would imagine, yeah, it's going to be hard to move. No, it's not, that's not the reason, actually. No. We have new standards for our sign. Okay. So if they take it down, they would have to now go for the new okay. sign ordinance. If they keep it, when they do their application, they'll, they uh, they'll, they'll they consider it the same, yeah, yeah. same size. Interesting. Yeah, it's interesting. And the only other question I had was, did I miss Howell Day? No, it's in October. It's October? You know, we should have got him and told him he did. <laughs> <laughs> um, I, I still believe you. I've been away a while, so. Okay. Um, that's really all I had. I'm glad to see you guys are all still here. I'm sorry. Pauline is gone, obviously. But what are you doing these days? I'm no. a reporter still, but I'm covering medical stuff. So, in November, I was sitting in uh, on a restaurant in San Diego, and I looked at my phone and I was like, "Oh, there's a council meeting tonight, and I'm in San Diego," and that wasn't so tough. So, <laughs> all right. Things are good. Thank <coughs> you very much, guys. How's your daughter? She's good. Awesome. He's the best. Thank you very much. San Diego's Good great. Good to see you, Adam. Yeah,